Congratulations. You did it. We did it. Athena Mono is the only positive phase three trial here at ASCO. And I want to celebrate with you together. Athena Mono is a randomized phase three trial in patients with newly diagnosed advanced ovarian and tubal cancer who respond to platinum-based chemotherapy. Randomized four to one to recaparib versus placebo in maintenance treatment regardless of molecular signature. So newly diagnosed patient responds to chemotherapy. Let's give them recaparib to keep them in remission to help them live longer and help them live better. Well, we, you say, well, I've already done that. Yeah, but questions remain. Questions remain about what the right dose is, what the right patient is, what the right molecular signature is, and this did it. You did it because you enrolled to this wonderful trial. 538 patients, again, randomized, recaprib to placebo, with the primary endpoint being investigator progression-free survival. The primary endpoint, HRD positive based on the foundation medicine score, hazard ratio of 0.47. So if you get placebo, on average, you live cancer-free for 11 months. If you get recaprib, it's more than double to almost 29. 11.3 to 28.7 months. If that doesn't convince you in the HRD subset, I don't know what can. You're like, well, that was HRD. How about all comers? All comers, the hazard ratio is still very acceptable and exciting and statistically significant. 0.52 with an increase of 9.2 months to 20.2 months, still doubled it. What does that mean? It means that every patient who with frontline ovarian cancer that responds to chemotherapy should be considered for a PARP inhibitor, maybe even recaparib. Let me tell you another way is that at two years in the HRD subset, almost twice more, two times more remained progression free. And there was no decrement in quality of life based on the patient reported outcomes, which you helped your patients submit. Now, all my enthusiasm has to be balanced against adverse reactions. Like all PARP inhibitors, the most common adverse reaction is GI, basically nausea, occasionally diarrhea. Number two, fatigue. Number three, bone marrow suppression. Recaprib has a unique Initial elevation in the liver enzymes, no highs law, generally resolves with it without dose modification. So, from ASCO 2022, congratulations, you did it. Athena Mono and many of you are co authors on this paper, which was published on Monday at ASCO simultaneously in the Journal of Clinical Oncology and other papers coming up soon at IGCS and ESMO and ESCO. So thank you for your participation. Thank you to NGOT, who is our partner, Rebecca Crystallite. Thank you to our Japanese colleagues, Kaichi Fujiwara. But most importantly, thank you to the patients. Because without the patients and their families, this would have never been possible.